Thursday night and the big story on Action News tonight is an eruption of violence and a deadly police involved shooting in Philadelphia. Action News reporter Dan Quayer is live at police headquarters and Dan, you've got the full story. That's right, Jim. On any given day, there are a number of shootings across the city, but in this case, investigators say two undercover officers were right there when a man produced a handgun and started firing during a large fight that broke out in Kensington. The scene, the intersection of Clearfield and Water in Kensington, 629 this evening, an assist the officer call blares out across police radios. There was a large fight on the highway and the fight was uh, was so chaotic. In fact, they were bumping into the officer's car. Unknown to those involved in the fight, there were two undercover police officers and the silver Nissan assigned to the narcotic strike force. Investigators say as they began to exit the car to attempt to break up the fight, things got worse. This male fired at least three shots. Uh, two were, were directly into the crowd in the direction of the officers. Both of those officers discharged their weapons. They fired at least six shots. Uh, this male was struck once in the shoulder and once in the abdomen. The male, said to be in his late 40s, early 50s, was rushed to Temple University Hospital where he later died. A 52-year-old woman who was not shot but was injured in the altercation was being treated. It's just completely and totally out of control. And, you know, we hear this all over the city. People are outside just trying to enjoy a nice evening. Fights happen. You know, we're never going to be able to avoid that. But when somebody produces a handgun, these are the things that, that, that can happen. Now, the two officers were not injured. There were a number of surveillance cameras on the scene, and police are gathering the footage to see what was captured. The police shooting investigative team, internal affairs, and the DA's office are handling the investigation. Live at police headquarters, I'm Dan Coyar, Channel 6, Action News. Jim. Thank you, Dan.